morning. We're here on Pasture Hill Road, just to the west of Hayward Heath Railway Station and the Leisure Centre, which is at the bottom of the road here. So if you know where Dolphin Leisure Centre is, that is off Pasture Hill Road. And I'm about to show you around number 55, which is a three bedroom terrace house in this cul-de-sac. Um, very popular road, super uh, popular obviously with commuters because you're on top of the station. Um, schools wise, you're within walking distance of uh, Harlands Primary School, which is barely half a mile. The railway station is 0.4 of a mile. And uh, children from this side of town go to Warden Park Secondary Academy School, which is over in Cookfield and just the other side of Bluntswood, uh, which um, is a 1.2 mile walk from where we are. If you don't know it, Warden Park School in Cookfield is through the woods. Um, there's a proper roadway through the woods, so you're not expecting your children to walk through the woods, but there's a proper roadway. Thankfully, no cars can drive through it, so it's bollarded, but um, a really lovely walk through. And if you want to go for a, a nice drink or a bite to eat or a walk around Cookfield High Street, that's not a bad place to be. So, number 55, it's for sale with no one would chain. As you can see, the environment at the end of the cul-de-sac here, most people have sort of created extra parking. They have all got garages. This house has got a garage behind, but as we all know, no one uses a car for a garage these days. They're just very expensive sheds. So come and have a look. This one's had an entrance porch built on the front, so it's just giving it a little bit of extra space. So come inside. I would have thought you could have possibly got a downstairs cloakroom in this porch if you really, really wanted to. So there is a bit of potential to do some playing around. Big entrance hall with an understairs cupboard and a very useful downstairs cupboard with all the electrics in it the living room double aspect that great big long window there and of course doors out to the garden I'll show you out there in a moment with the garage so a nice big room I've seen a couple of people have actually taken this wall down and built blocked up the debt lounge area to make an enormous kitchen breakfast room so again you've got a little bit of options there but a nice little kitchen got a built-in oven and hob there's other bits and pieces, appliances in here, which might be for sale uh, separately. A handy understairs covered there. So come upstairs. Now the town centre, that's probably about a 15 minute walk. It's not even a mile from where we're standing. And you've got Sainsbury's and Waitrose supermarkets literally at the bottom of the road. Um, I mentioned the schools also off of Harlands Road, which is the road we are off here. Um, you've got the sixth form college, bathroom of course, and the back bedroom. There's two very big bedrooms you'll see in a second. So these two doubles, one at the front, one at the back. Give you an idea, you're just backing onto the garages. To get into the garages, you come in over through that gap of those two houses over there. It's at the bottom of Pasture Hill Road. So literally as you come in, and this is your garage, of course. Through those trees there, that is the leisure centre. So you're that close to the leisure centre. So if you like your fitness, or just want a quick coffee, that's your nearest coffee stop. Front bedroom, again, good size double. And that's just another handy linen cupboard. Good look around at the front. And then the front third bedroom. Usual old thing, it's a typical single size bedroom. Or most people want them as a home office, but again, handy cupboard there. And then come outside, I'll show you the garden. So I probably skimmed over it, but I should have said, as you can see, the owner has created a sort of gravel hard standing there so you can at least get a car off the road there. And then the back garden. Really nice. It's a shame we're not seeing it in midsummer, but as you can see, a great big terrace with all the sunshine, a bit of lawn, and of course, the garage at the bottom, which we all want. We're feeling full of junk. It looks like it's had a modern door put on it, so I think the door's been replaced. And then when you come around the back here, you can see the neighbour on that side has obviously added a conservatory. So there is a bit of potential to extend the property as well if you wanted to, subject to planning consent. There you go. That's number 55 Pasture Hill Road. It's for sale through Mansell McTaggart in Hayward Heath. There is no chain. If you'd like to have a look, give us a quick call. And uh, if you are seriously looking for properties, do subscribe to this YouTube channel uh, or follow us on Instagram or Facebook. You'll see we're doing these mini, mini reel videos on those, which are a lot quicker than my videos. But everyone says that they do like these. They feel that they're very thorough. Hope you like them. Any feedback, do let me have it. Thanks for watching.